is it makes a really pretty dishwasher. When you load your dishwasher full up with VS to wear, you open it up, it's like this rainbow of happiness. start a new series of videos on, uh, I'm going to title it My Favorite Things. Now this will be the first one. I'm not trying to be pro-consumerism with this. I'm sort of the opposite. I'm going to be highlighting things I've found in my life that work the way they're supposed to. They're quality but not expensive. Maybe a little more earth friendly. Uh, that sort of thing. So, I have a Pinterest page that's uh, that's actually called My Favorite Things. I'll link it below and you can go over there and pop over and see some of the things I'll be talking about. But the thing I want to talk about today first is my favorite uh, dishes. They are right here. Fiesta Ware. Now you might think that's a little old school, but they're really not. The thing I like about Fiesta Ware is its durability. I ha hit these things on the side of the sink all the time. I have had these dishes, some of them for probably 20 years, that long. I started collecting them because of the colors. The thing I like about them is they do not chip. Like I said, I've hit them against the side of a porcelain sink. I've hit them on granite countertops. Um, I don't pull them out of the dishwasher with chips on them. Uh, it just doesn't happen. Now, if you do drop it on a ceramic floor, it's going to break. Um, but these are extremely durable. Their price point is pretty good. There's a there's actually a Seconds shop near me that's um, that sells Fiesta Seconds, and I have a, bought a lot of them from there. And they might be just like a little grain under the glaze or something. No big, real huge deal as far as what the flaw is. Um, there's a couple of myths out there about Fiesta Ware. If you buy the new stuff, the stuff that, I guess they started reproducing it maybe in the 80s. That is, that is what I'm talking about here. I'm not talking about the vintage Fiesta Ware. The new stuff is lead free. It's the older stuff that has lead in it. That was common in dishes in the 40s and 50s uh, to have lead in them, so that's not a big deal. All your vintage dishes might have some amount of lead in them, but the new Fiesta does not have lead in it, and it'll even say lead free. These are dishwasher safe, they are microwave safe, and you can get in every shape and size you want. This is, of course, just a dinner plate. There's a few of my colors. Up in here, I have bowls. I have these little things, these are great for snacks for kids. Cereal bowls. These, this is a good size. They make a larger one of this. It's a bit, little bit larger. You can see these two different sizes here. But like I said, I'm hitting them against each other. They're not chipping. On the flip side of that, I have these dishes. I bought them because I like the colors too. Just for a little bit of contrast, this is a, another bowl. It looks just as nice as the Fiesta Ware. These are made by Oneida, which is, you know, they're a good, they're a good dishware company. Can you see that? That and worse occurs just, just from use. These are actually in pretty good shape. But um, that's the kind of thing you'll see on dishes after years of use, and even worse. And I don't have that on my Fiesta Ware. I want to show you a few of the different kinds of serving pieces you can get. And this doesn't even scratch the surface of all the different shapes and sizes that Fiesta has. Um, I have a couple of platters here. There's this one and a small one. This one here. I love this color. That's one of their newer colors, maybe in the last six or seven years. I really like it. This is a big platter, um, and it's it would hold a pizza. They also make vases. These are a couple different sizes of their vases. Like I said, I have an outlet around here, and that's where I get a lot of my stuff. Um, these are little pie dishes. They, they work great as little bowls, but they have like a scallop on them for pies. Uh, I do believe you can cook in these, too. Um, I don't know what the rules on cooking with them are. I'll try to look that up and put it on here. But um, I think you can put these these in the oven. So maybe you can make like a chicken pot pie or something. This is another platter, and it has a little different design around the edges. It was, I believe, a millennium sort of commemorative uh, design. And I had some plates with this design, too. I don't think I still have them. I think I sold them. I sort of de-stashed my Fiesta a few years ago and got rid of a lot of duplicates and things. This is another serving bowl, make a great fruit bowl. 
Look at the bottom. Look at the design on the bottom of that. This is one of the dishes that looks better upside down. <laughs> and it is, um, it's a special commemorative as well. I'm sorry. These are a couple that I picked up at a garage sale. Um, they have an unusual shape. So that gives you a little bit of an idea of, of what shapes and sizes you can get Fiesta Ware in. Um, it's made by Homer Laughlin. It's been made by Homer Laughlin for decades. Uh, but the new stuff, that's what you want if you're looking for a sustainable type of dinnerware that is going to last for years, serve your family, and be tough, uh, but pretty at the same time. Um, I know they have a few that have some patterns in them, but I don't, I'm not familiar with those. And I think they're sort of short limit runs. But you're not going to find your pretty flowery, um, china sort of look in the Fiesta Ware. It's mostly solids and they have black and white. So you can go with that, that black and white scheme if you like it. You could get like all one color. You can do what I do and just get a ton of colors. That's my first favorite things video. I hope to do some more and I hope you've enjoyed this. And like I said, this is not to promote consumerism or to get people out there buying things. This is so that if you are ready to get something that you, is going to last and you want to buy once and be done and not buy again, um, as far as dishes go, Fiesta Ware is a, is a very good option. So I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you. Bye-bye.